All right, guys, so with the uh, kind of four hip movements here, you're just gonna need a step. You can go hands on your side if you'd like to use your hands for balance or sometimes here, here. Those are other options as well, just for progressions. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna sink down and tap. So I may do like 10 reps there. <clears throat> From here, I'm gonna slightly bend the knee, kick out to the side. Then I'm gonna combine the first two and I'm gonna go down, hold, and kick out to the outside. And then I'm gonna go into one where I step back and come up into a runner's pose. So I'll so show you a side view here. Because you can make this quad dominant or you can make this hip dominant. And so how I would make it more quad dominant is I'm going to think straight down, kind of bending more at the knee, like you can see here. Or if I wanted to get more into my hip on this left side, I'd sink back a little bit more, like you can see here. Okay, so it's down, it's kick outs, it's combine the two, step back. 